Welcome to our podcast, where we uncover the most important and interesting stories for you. In this episode, we will discuss the mystery of what's green on Mars, as Perseverance's latest rock analysis raises even more questions. NASA's Perseverance rover has made yet another unusual discovery on Mars, spotting greenish spots inside a rock. The mysterious discovery was made by the rover's Sherlock Watson camera that took a nighttime mosaic image of the Malgosa Crest abrasion patch in the Serpentine Rapids. The photo also shows white and black spots. To see what lies inside the rock, Perseverance made an abrasion patch 5 centimeters in diameter in an outcrop named Wallace Butte. The large green spot lies in the upper left portion of the image and is approximately 2 millimeters, about 0.08 inches, in diameter. Oxidized iron is responsible for the color of rocks on Earth similar to those found on Mars. It is also what makes the blood red. The green tinge is also common in rocks on our planet. They are formed when liquid water seeps through sediment before hardening into rock. A chemical reaction then transforms oxidized iron to its reduced form, lending a green hue to a rock. The reduction reaction can either happen because of microbes or decaying organic matter in the rocks on Earth. Chemical interaction between sulfur and iron can also cause iron reduction reactions without the help of microorganisms. However, what caused the green color in the Martian rocks is a mystery, as the rover didn't have much space to safely place its arms holding the Sherlock and Pixel instruments directly on top of the green spot. The rover recently also clicked an image of a black and white striped rock on Mars. It came across the odd rock while climbing the steep slopes of the Jezero crater and marching towards its rim. The rock was named Freya Castle and scientists think that as the rover continues to climb up the crater, it might come across more such rocks. It is the only stone of its kind observed on Mars and completely different from the underlying bedrock. Experts think that the rock likely rolled downhill from somewhere higher. That's all from this podcast. Thanks for listening. We have many more such compelling episodes for you. Enjoy them. Do share your opinion in the comment box and subscribe to us for more.